Hey sweet friends, it's Carrie. Happy Tuesday. Hope y'all had a wonderful, beautiful day today. I am here tonight to share with y'all my most recent collection haul. This one is a pretty large one. Um, it is from an Etsy shop. And this particular shop I've ordered from once before, like long, long time ago, at the very beginning of my wax journey before I even started this channel. Um, the name of the shop is Penny's Wax Melts. I'm gonna see if I can show you, cover up my address. There we go. Penny's Wax Melts. The owner's name is Mary, Mary Penny. Um, she is on Etsy. When I ordered from her a couple of years ago, I remember her stuff just being really pretty, like just not overly done with the decorations. I mean, she does decorate, but it's, you know, kind of understated. Um, I remember her stuff performing well for me. So one day I was just on Etsy and I happened to come across her Etsy shop and she had a lot of things marked down on clearance, mainly her two ounce, um, set shots like this and normally I think she has these going for like 250 on her on her site and the day that I went on she had those babies marked down like 75 cents 85 cents and I was like why not so I placed a pretty big order I want to say I got maybe 35 little of little scent cups um, and then I got one of her scoopables that she also had on clearance and two of her squeezy wax melts that she had marked down as well. So um, it did come in this big box and very, very well packaged with, you know, all of this fun stuff, <laughs> bubble wrap and some, you know, protective paper like that. Um, and I will say before I start that there was one little error on my order. Um, I had ordered a scoopable and instead of the scoopable, um, I got a scent shot. So I emailed her and I just told her, hey, is there any way I could get that scoop? And she was so sweet. She emailed me back and said, absolutely. And the scoopable came to me within a few days. So. The customer service, top notch. She's very, very sweet, very responsive to messages. So let's just get into this. Um, now I did not get a business card, but I got an invoice in my invoice. Oh my gosh, you guys, let's see. One, two, three, four, five pages long. <laughs> um, she has a handwritten note here. Thank you, Carrie, please enjoy. So yeah, now on her scent shots, she does not put these scent notes. Um, and it would take me forever, you know, to get on the phone and try to look them up for you. And I really don't want to keep y'all waiting. So if you're curious on the set notes of any of these, you could definitely get on her Etsy page and uh, check it out there. Um, most of these are self-explanatory. Uh, let's see. Now I will uh, maybe try to tell you the prices because I can quickly glance at my invoice and tell you how much I spent on each one. They were not all the same price. Um, I mean, they ranged from like 70 to 80 to 90 cents. There were a couple of them that maybe were like a dollar and something, but yeah, I just think that's a great deal for a two ounce scent shot. So let's get started. She did send me quite a few samples as well, but we'll save the samples for the end. I'm going to stretch out my feet before they fall asleep. <laughs> okay, so let's just get started. Again, um, this is Penny's Wax Melts. So she has a little label on the front and the labels kind of remind me of um, the pharmacist's daughter. You know, they, they kind of have that brown kind of craft paper vibe, which I really like. So you get your set name. This is Belize Tropical Cabana. And this one was priced at, let's see if I can find it. Um, here we go, 85 cents, 85 cents. And she does do some decorating, but it's not like too much. I feel like it's just really pretty, you know, very simple. So some of these are very easy to pop out. So we'll pop this one out. 
this is really pretty. When I smell this, I get, I feel like I get a combination of aquatic and floral. There is definitely something in this that is giving me floral vibes, but I can, I can take this. Like, because it's mixed in with that aquatic stuff, it's really pretty. And it does, it just kind of like, just takes you to the beach somewhere. That is really, really nice. And um, because I haven't ordered from her for quite a while, I'm probably going to start off with um, cutting these in half, and that's probably what I'm gonna end up doing. And then, you know, if some of these are just like powerhouses, I might try cutting them in thirds, but I think for the majority of them, we'll do um, halvesies on these. All right, so my next one is blueberry pecan waffles. And this one was 90 cents. And this one just has some really simple glitter. I can tell you that her wax is very soft. Ooh, the blueberry is strong on this one. I don't know how much pecan waffles I'm getting in this, but the blueberry, for sure. Oh yeah, so that's a good one. I like that one. All right, my next one is peach bellini. And this one was 77 cents. Now this is one of the ones that I cannot get to pop out. It is in there really, really well. Yeah, I get the peach. I'm wondering though if maybe her shots are stronger on the bottom because not being able to pop this one out, it's a little bit light on the top. I mean, I get the peach, but it's a little bit soft, a little bit light. And uh, how many of y'all enjoy the peach Bellini candle from Bath and Body Works? Oh my gosh. I don't know why I have not bought that yet this year. Um, I normally already have that purchased and in my candle cabinet ready to go for the summertime. I need to go get that candle. I love that candle. It is such a strong, strong candle. So this one is kind of giving me the, the vibes of that candle. So yeah, I, I could see pairing this with that candle and really get the peach thing going. So that smells yummy. All right, my next one is Apple and Jack Peels. Most of my shots that I got are spring and summer scents. There are a few um, like for fall and the holidays that I'll just put aside and save. Um, this one, Apple and Jack Peels was $1.11. I love Apple Jack Peels. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is such a yummy, Mm, such a yummy holiday scent. So yeah, I will be putting this one aside for the holidays. This is giving me like Thanksgiving, Christmas vibes. Ooh, I love it. I love it, I love it. Oh, that is good, 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 good. Oh yeah. Kind of also maybe makes me think of like a mulled cider in a way. I love that one. All right, my next one is Caribbean or Caribbean, however you may say. And this one was 77 cents. And this one is really simply decorated. Oh my gosh, this is so good. This is amazing. This is like creamy, creamy pineapple pina colada oh my gosh oh my gosh like that that could be named pina colada because it smells exactly like a pina colada i get pineapple in this it's delicious love it all right my next one is cake batter ice cream and this one was a dollar and eleven cents and this one is another one that I can't get to come out, but it's just plain white. So 
So I'm beginning to think that maybe <laughs> her shots are stronger, like once you pop them out, because the ones that I can't get to come out, those seem to be very, very light. Like when I smell this, honestly, I'm not getting anything. I mean, maybe, maybe a teeny hint of like a creamy vanilla, but it's super, super light. So I will be anxious to pop this one out and see what happens like once it comes out of the cup. But yeah, I'll keep you posted on that one. Next we have Summer Market. Summer Market, let's see how much are you? This one, 85 cents. It's really pretty. Ooh, this is fun. This is really fruity. Like really sweet and fruity. Maybe, is it berries that I'm getting in this? It's just a very sweet berry scent. But I like it. Yeah, that one is, is a strong one on coal, so I really like that one. All right, my next one here is cantaloupe. Had to get me a cantaloupe scent. I love me some melon scents, you guys, for the summer. Woo, any kind of melon. Cantaloupe, watermelon, honeydew, I love them all. This one was 94 cents. And look how pretty with that orange. I don't know if the light is like, oh my gosh, sorry about that. But it's like orange. So this is interesting because when I smell this, I'm not thinking cantaloupe. Because I think cantaloupe has a very distinct smell in wax and I don't get cantaloupe in this. I get, um, I don't even know what I'm getting. I don't know, that's interesting. Am I getting like, this one almost smells a little peachy to me, that's weird. But you know, we know that anything can change on warm, so I'll keep you updated on that. My next one is Hillbilly Homebrew, you guys. I love Hillbilly Homebrew. <laughs> I've had it a couple of other times in wax and it is to die for. Absolutely love it. It's like a mold cider scent. Uh, if you have not tried Hillbilly Homebrew, you need to. And actually, I've tried it from more than one vendor and every vendor that has sent it to me, I've loved it. Yeah, it's just so good. Very much a holiday scent though. Um, Hillbilly Homebrew, let's see how much were you. You were a dollar and thirty one cents. So there you go. Oh, yeah, this is so good. Yeah, it's great. It's, it's just a mold cider. Oh. You get all of those mulling spices. So, again, this is going to be put aside for the holidays because this is just holiday all over. Love it. All right, next we have Watermelon Patch. And Watermelon Patch was 94 cents. This is another one I can't get to come out, so. Yeah, so this is a little bit stronger than the other ones that I couldn't get to come out. Um, yeah, I get the watermelon. This actually kind of reminds me of like a watermelon bubble gum, but it's good. Next we have watermelon citron mint. And this one was, let's see. What is citron, you guys? I've heard of it, but I couldn't tell you what it is. Is it like an herb? I don't know. I may have to look that up when I'm done. Um, this was 77 cents. Oops. Ooh, okay. 
Oh, wow. This is nice. Yeah, this is watermelon. And I do get some mint. But there's, there's something in here that's really strong. And I'm assuming it's the citron. I gotta figure out what citron is because I have no idea. But that one is yummy and strong. Very good. All right, next one is blueberry meringue tort. So, okay, T-O-R-T-E, that's tort, right? Is a tort like a tart? <laughs> I don't know. Oh gosh, okay. This one was 77 cents. And it's really pretty, that blue color. This one won't come out either. But this is strong on the top. Yeah, mm. that is a strong blueberry. Blueberry is another flavor or scent that I love to pair with my blueberry candle in the summertime. Yeah, that's good. All right, next we have Gain Apple Mango Tango. Okay, so I've got to preface this by saying I am not the biggest fan of laundry, and you guys know that. But, but, I really, really like Gain Apple Mango Tango. We um, have had that, like, you know, my family, we've had that detergent. Um, we've bought it at the store. My son just loves the way it smells. And so when I saw that it was starting to, you know, be offered in wax, I was like, okay, maybe I should try this. Um, it's so good, you guys. Oh, this one went for a dollar. Um, because like, when I smell this, I don't smell laundry at all. Yeah, I don't get laundry. I just get fruity and tropical. I love it. I love it so much. So I figured maybe if I am gonna do laundry, scents and wax, this might be the way to go for me because I really, really like that a lot. All right, next we have Sex on the Beach. And this one was, let's see. Is Sex on the Beach, isn't that like a cocktail? <laughs> um, I think it is. Because I feel like, don't people go up like, you know, to the bar and say, I'll have a Sex on the Beach. I need to look that up too. Uh, I'm going to be Googling a lot of things after this video. Uh, this was 77 cents. Ooh, yummy, yummy. Oh, this is good. Oh, I wish I had the scent notes. This is so good. This is, yeah, tropical, fruity. Oh, wow. I get some melon. Oh, that is so good. That is so good. Good, 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 good. Love that one. All right, next we have cinnamon spice cake. And this one was... $1.18. Ooh, this is nice. This is not red hot cinnamon. This is like bakery cinnamon. Ooh, that's good. I get that cakey note, but it is not spicy in the least. I mean, I get the cinnamon, but it is like a muted cinnamon, like a very subtle cinnamon. That is delicious. Love that one. All right, next we have pink lemonade Fizz, and this one was 77 cents. There you go. Hmm. So this is kind of soft and light. Um, I don't really get fizz. I was kind of expecting to get like fizzy pop. Don't get any of that. Um, 
I don't really even get like pink lemonade vibes off of this. It's really soft and really, really light. So we will have to see how that one does on warm. My next one is Copper Hue Suntan Lotion. And this one was, let's see, 89 cents. And I love, love Copper Tone. Um, that oh yeah love it love it love it oh my gosh oh my gosh this is so fun this <laughs> oh my gosh okay when i smell this i i can close my eyes and i can imagine myself at the pool or at the beach and walking by someone who is like laying out who has just covered themselves in copper tone Oh my gosh, that is so funny. That is hilarious because it does. It smells like someone has just lathered themselves up in copper tone sunscreen. That is awesome. That is gonna be a really, really fun one in the summertime. Love that. All right, next we have Maui. And Maui was 85 cents. Anybody out there ever been to Maui? So this girl right here has never been to Hawaii. Um, my parents have. I've got you know family and friends that have. It is on my bucket list. I want to go to Hawaii like one day before I leave this earth. Yeah, I have to go. <laughs> this is good. Um, Yeah, this is good. It's it's kind of an aquatic beachy scent with maybe a little bit of like tropical fruit in the background. Yeah, that's a good one. All right, next we have Mojito. And Mojito was 85 cents. I have had Mojitos before. Um, and I do enjoy them. I enjoy them like with fruit, like a watermelon mojito or a strawberry mojito. Yum, yum. Oh, there you go. Yeah, and this is just straight up like lime, like a lime mojito. It's good. It's really, really good. And I've got a lot of lime things that I'm saving for the summer. Um, and this is going to be great. Love that one. All right, next. Okay. <laughs> so this one here, um, I know you guys are probably going to say, what in the world, Carrie? Why did you get that one? Um, and I don't know. But remember, 2023 for Carrie is the year to branch out. So that is what I did with this one. This is Petals of Spring. I know it's floral. What was I thinking? This was 94 cents, um, but it's really pretty. Look at that. And it's really nice, you guys. It's so nice. It, it is floral, but but it's it's just sweet, and it's like delicate, and I think I could melt this. I really think I could, but I'm going to have to wait, I think, until like maybe April because this kind of, when I smell this, it kind of gives me Easter vibes, you know? I'm going to definitely melt it um, because it's just very sweet, and I think that would be a great one like for Easter Sunday maybe, so I'll keep you posted. All right, I got to stretch out. Okay, next we have pumpkin apple butter. And this one was $1.24. And I remember my first order with, um, with Penny's Wax Melts. I mainly did just get a lot of her like fall pumpkin kinds of things. And I remember how good they were. And this is awesome. 
This is so good. You get that apple butter, ooh man. With some spice. This is, this, this is a little heavy on the spice, so I'm not sure non-spice lovers would enjoy this one, but I love it. Oh man, that is good. Probably will put that aside for closer to like September, October, but that's delish. All right, next we have pumpkin crunch cake. And this was a dollar and six cents. So this one, I'm not getting a whole lot of pumpkin. I'm just mainly getting like kind of a creamy cakey note. Um, so we'll have to melt that and see maybe if the pumpkin comes out once I warm that one. All right, next we have Summer Dreams. And this one was 85 cents. It's really pretty pink. Oh, this is nice. I get pink sugar in this. I do, right off the bat. So I'm gonna be anxious to get back on her site and check out the scent notes to see if I'm right, because I do. I get pink sugar. In fact, that's all I get on that, and it's really pretty. That could be great in the bedroom or bathroom. Love that. All right, my next one is coconut mango. And coconut mango was 77 cents. Pretty self-explanatory. You would expect to get some coconut and some mango in this. Yeah, her wax is really soft, you guys. Ooh, this is good. Very good. And yes, I get coconut and yes, I get mango and they are perfectly balanced. One is not stronger than the other. Ooh, that's yummy, yummy, yummy. All right, we're getting there, guys. <laughs> I think this might honestly be the most scent shots I've ever ordered at one time. Uh, this is Orange Ginger Fizz, and this one went for 77 cents. Um, so y'all know, like, my thing for orange is I don't really go for like orange juice or real tart acidic orange. I like more like creamy orange, tropical orange. This one I mainly got because of that fizz. I was hoping there was gonna be like some um, like fizzy pop action going on. I am not gonna pop this one out because this one looks like it's gonna get all over me. Oh, I love this. This is so good. Oh, this is so good. I do get some fizzy, but it's not really strong on the fizzy. And that orange is like a creamy orange the way I like it. This could actually be like a cocktail. This is really good. I love that one. Orange ginger fizz. All right, my next one is apple punch. And apple punch went for, let's see here. I also don't think I've ever had a an invoice <laughs> this many pages before. Uh, this was 94 cents. And it's really pretty. Ooh, okay, interesting. I don't get apple when I smell this. I don't get apple. I kind of get like raspberry, maybe blackberry. I get a dark berry scent, not really apple. It's still really good though. Yeah, excited for that one. And we all know that things can change once you get them in a warmer. This one is spring cleaning. <laughs> and this one was <coughs> uh, spring cleaning, where are you? This one was 77 cents. 
and it's so pretty look at that I don't know if the light is making it not focus but it's really really pretty it's like a yellow wax with some green sparkle okay I was hoping that this was going to be lemony you know because you think spring cleaning you think kind of lemon scents and it is it's so good it's 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 more lemon cleaner than it is anything it's not bakery lemon but I think for you know for spring cleaning on a spring cleaning day at least for me I don't want to smell bakery lemon I want to smell lemon cleaner like I want my house to smell clean so that is a good one I like that one my next one here is strawberry macaroon and vanilla whip or macaron however you say it and this one was let's see 85 cents and it's just a solid pink color y'all like macaroons macarons whatever i do i really do i don't get them so much um because at least the places where they sell them i feel like they're a little bit pricey they're a little bit expensive but if i do get them i really enjoy eating them <laughs> they're really good this is good. This is a great strawberry scent. Yeah, just a creamy, because I get that vanilla, so it's creamy. It's like a creamy strawberry. It's really yummy. All right, next we have Paradise Daiquiri. And this one was 85 cents. So yeah, this is just Kind of your typical basic tropical fruity drink I get some orange and maybe a hint of like some melon but that's gonna be a good one for the summer next is pumpkin souffle and the pumpkin souffle was a dollar and 31 cents so I feel like her um, pumpkin scents and like her fall holiday scents were maybe the ones that were a little bit um, on the higher end of the price, like a dollar, a dollar twenty, something like that. Oh, this is good. This is really good. This is just such a creamy, yummy pumpkin scent with no spice it's just so yummy like if you had a pumpkin milkshake that is so good all right next we have hansel and gretel's house i love this scent so much this was a dollar 39 and another one i can't oh i did i got it to pop out okay look at that yeah i always get this scent um for the holidays because it's just to me to my nose it's such a like yummy gingerbread scent and that's what i get with this yeah that gives me gingerbread vibes so i'll probably save that for the holidays all right we're almost done y'all <laughs> uh this okay this one is home sweet home now this is the scent that i actually i did not order in a shot i wanted it in her scoop um so when my original package came i didn't get it in the scoop i got it in a shot so i reached out to her and i said oh hey mary you know this particular scent i think i ordered it in a scoop um, but i got it in a shot instead is there any way that i could get the scoop sent out to me i'll return the shot and she's like oh that is so my fault you keep the shot and i'll send you the scoop and she did and i got the scoop a couple of days later and i got to keep the shot so great customer service I really appreciate that so home sweet home I know is a Yankee uh, candle um, oh wait, let me tell you how much this shot went for first um, but actually I didn't have to pay for the shot um, so couldn't even tell you <laughs> um, but it's really, really pretty. 
Yeah, I know a lot of people don't care for this scent because it is very like, I don't want to call it craft store, but it does kind of have that vibe, like, you know, cinnamon broom and spicy. And I love it though. Like this is something I would want my house to smell like all the time. I really, really, really like that one. So, all right, next we have peaches and cream. And this one went for 85 cents. Ooh, okay. <laughs> this is so, so peachy. And I love it. Oh, wow. That is a good peach. Oh, that's so good. Like that, to me, is like the juicy, kind of fleshy part of the peach. Ooh, that's good. Yum, yum. All right, next we have Island Fresh. And Island Fresh was 85 cents. That's a really pretty blue. Okay, yeah, I wish I had the scent notes with me. Um, Cause this is laundry, very much a laundry scent. Maybe laundry like mixed in with some aquatic notes, like watery notes. Um, yeah, it's it's laundry for sure. Um, and I don't know, like I wonder what, what it would be like if I maybe mix this with the Gain Apple Mango Tango. I don't know, we might try that and see. But that's, that's kind of heavy on the laundry. A little bit more laundry than I like, but we'll see. Um, next we have pineapple coconut water. And this one was 80 cents. And it's a really pretty yellow color. She has got a great pineapple, you guys. Oh, this is so good. It's not quite pina colada, but it is very creamy. Oh, it's so good. It's not like that real tart, acidic pineapple, like pineapple juice. Oh, this is good. This is really good. Like, I mean, it's close to being up there with like pina colada, but that is so yummy. She's got a great pineapple. All right, three more shots to go. <laughs> Next one is Nana's Kitchen. And this one was Nana's Kitchen, where are you? Let's see how much this one was. Nana's Kitchen was 90 cents. And I got this because I just thought it was gonna be kind of like a, you know, like a grandma's kitchen kind of scent, like a kitchen spice or maybe like cookies baking. Yeah, and that's what I get with this. I don't really get spice. I get kind of like a, like cookies baking. Ooh, it's good. That is good. <coughs> All right, two more. This is Bermuda Triangle, and Bermuda Triangle was 85 cents. <coughs> Excuse me. And I am like, almost at 40 minutes. I'm sorry, this is gonna be a long video, y'all. But I really wanted to show y'all all my yummy stuff. Ooh, okay. This is, this is like maybe kind of a orange grapefruit, kind of like a real citrusy scent. It's very tart, but it's good. Yeah, that's a good one. And dun, 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 box is empty. And the last shot is strawberry raspberry guava. And this one went for, where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it? Uh, this one went for 77 cents. And it is a really pretty pink color. Oh, this is nice. I could see this 
being a body care. Like it's really, really nice. I get the guava, I get the raspberry, and I do get the strawberry. Like all of those things are there. Ooh, that could be, that could be a body care. If that were a body care, I would wear it. <laughs> That's really good. Whew, okay. Uh, only 40 minutes and we're done with the shots. <laughs> so, um, let me show you the two little squeezies that I got. Um, and I'll be honest, the only reason I got these is because they were on sale. Um, I normally don't go for squeeze wax um, just because I feel like it's a little bit pricey, but hers were marked down to $4.95, so I decided I would just grab a couple. Um, I have used squeeze wax in the past, and I've had okay luck. Um, I think a lot of it depends on the vendor and a lot of it depends on the scent too, but I got two of hers. Um, they are four ounces and they come in this little squeeze container. Um, this scent is Bear Claws. So, okay, y'all know that, you know, PPW is my, like, without a doubt, number one all-time favorite bakery scent, but I also love me some Bear Claws, you guys. If you can find a vendor that does bear claws, like just the way it needs to be done with like the, you know, a little bit of spice and then that doughy, oh my gosh. And this is really, really good. Ooh, yeah, that is delicious. And I remember reading on her site, you know, she said you just do a few little squirts in your warmer. Um, so I'm going to be excited to try this and report back to y'all and let you know. And then the last one I got was in the scent Key Lime because I thought with summer coming up and I have all of this lime stuff, I've got some candles and some wax and I just think Key Lime, lime in general, is such a great um, summer scent. Let's see if I can. So I wanted to get one in Key Lime. Ooh, yes, that is good. Yeah, smells great, smells like lime. <laughs> so I will be excited to use these and I will report back to y'all in an empties very soon. Um, okay, and then I wanted to show you the scoop. So um, Home Sweet Home is the scent that I had ordered my scoop in that we had had a little mix up but she got it out to me super, super quick. So I got my little uh, scoop like this. And then here it is in Home Sweet Home. It's a four ounce scoopable. Little decoration on the top. Oh, it's so nice, you guys. I love this scent. I know not everybody does because people say it's very, very like, almost annoyingly spicy but I just think the name like suits it it just makes your home excuse me my nose is like I think smelling all of this <laughs> Ugh. it just really does make your home smell like come on in you guys come on into my house you know my house is your house come on in take a load off sit down it it just makes your home feel so welcoming and cozy and warm and inviting and I love it, so. And I have never had one of her scoops before, so I'm really excited to see how that one performs. So that is it as far as everything that I ordered, but she did send me some samples, which I thought was very, very generous. Oh, you know what? I didn't tell you the price on that scoop. Um, the scoop I got on sale for $4.68, so. All right, so let me show you my samples real quick and then hopefully I can get this video under 50 minutes. <laughs> oh, so sorry. All right, so she sent me a cute little paw print sample here in orange cream cupcake. Little paw print. That smells exactly like an orange cream sickle. Yeah. And I, 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 can, I think I can do that. That's not orange juice. It's, it's more of a creamy, almost like a vanilla 
orange, so I think I could do that. And my next sample is blueberries and cream and a pretty little flower. Oh, that's good. Yeah, she's got a good blueberry too. That smells really good. All right, my next one is another paw print in Citrus Splash. Yeah, that's very citrusy. Um, that almost, almost gives me lemon cleaner vibes. Like that would be a great one to put on on a cleaning day. Next one is China Rain in a flower. Ooh, that's pretty. That is very, ooh, like watery and aquatic, not beachy, just very fresh. Like almost what you would smell like after a rainstorm. Mm, that's nice. All right, my next one is Marshmallow Peeps in a cute little egg, little Easter egg. So this one, yeah, it's light. Um, I can see why she named it Peeps, um, but it, it's light. It's just like a very light vanilla set. Um, so we'll see if that one gets warmer. And my next sample is Artisan Bread in another paw print. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's just, um, that's, that's, just, that's a good bakery scent. Not sure if it gives me bread, but I can see that being a very good bakery scent, maybe a good blender. And my last one is Blue Raspberry Jolly Rancher in the paw print. Oh, yeah, that's good. That That's Jolly Rancher, yeah, she, she nailed that. Very sweet. So, wow, Mary, you were so generous with the samples. Thank you so much. And thank you for such an amazing order and for great customer service. I really do appreciate you. I'm excited to get to warming these. Um, and y'all for watching, I really apologize for such a long video. This might be one of the longest ones I've ever done, but I did want to show y'all all these amazing things. Again, this is Penny's Wax Melts on Etsy. Mary is the owner. Definitely check her out. I, I did um, check her site before I came on and she's still got some things on there on clearance. So yeah, give her a, give her a look. Thanks so much for clicking on, y'all. Thank you for being a part of my channel. Um, if you're not already a subscriber, I would love for you to be a part. Hit that like button and subscribe. Leave me a comment. Let me know um, what you're up to, what kinds of things you are melting. Y'all have a great rest of your Tuesday, and I will see you for the next video. Bye, everybody.